Hi folks, this is Daily Spirit for Youth, a daily devotional that helps you grow closer to God and apply His Word to your life. Today's reading entitled, Goodness of God, written by Pastor Samuel Akihari, is based on Nehemiah chapter 9, verses 1 to 15. I will read verse 6. You alone are the Lord. You made the heavens, even the highest heavens and all their starry host, the earth and all that is on it, the seas and all that is in them. You give life to everything, and the multitudes of heaven worship you. God's faithfulness and goodness are the two main things that form the background of the song Goodness of God. On the journey, these two things emerge as personal experiences for Jen and Brian, the founders of Bethel Music. The experience of God's goodness and faithfulness filled Jen's heart space, so she tried to record the lyrics of the song Goodness of God during a long drive through the countryside. For the people of Israel, God's goodness was unquestionable. From the very beginning, God chose the fathers of Israel and established an everlasting covenant with them. Even when they returned from exile during the time of Nehemiah, the Israelites were told to continue to remember God's goodness, faithfulness, and great deeds for them. The Israelites remembered God's faithfulness in the form of confession and prayer. The prayers that were offered were not in the form of requests, but rather in the form of acknowledgement that He is the only God who is faithful. As exiles, the Israelites recognized their past failures, yet God still cared for them and was faithful to them. Folks, remembering God's blessings in the past should raise our consciousness in times of failure and unfaithfulness. God never forgets His promises. Therefore, there is no need to dwell on failure and unfaithfulness. Keep looking to God and remembering His faithfulness so that every reminder of His goodness can encourage us to draw closer to Him. Ponder these questions. What are the goodness of God that the Israelites remember? What kind of God's goodness have you experienced in your life? Please share your thoughts in the comment section below or you can comment on other people's thoughts. Now let us pray. Dear Lord, remind us not to forget your goodness and your steadfast love. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you feel blessed through this devotional, please hit the like button and share it with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel to receive blessings every day. God bless you.